Um, well, the sixth grade is actually studying about the president and about the constitution. The president. The president, right. Everyone chose a president, and you're doing a report about that president. This is William McKinley. Like the president that I'm researching is like James Madison. And it's basically all I've so far on here, and all my research is here. Um, Garfield would juggle clubs to build up his muscles. George Washington was born on February 22nd, 1732. Are you ready to be president? You will be the commander in chief of the United States military. The president has the power to pardon anybody convicted of federal crimes. You also propose the federal government's budget. It would be kind of nice to live in the White House. I mean, it's really huge. I think it's pretty comfy to live in the White House. The president gets to live in the White House, which is a beautiful place. I know that the president has a cozy chair. I do have a lot of um, careers in mind for the future, like with singing and writing books and stuff, but I think it would be interesting to be president. Um, I guess that would be cool, just to... Pretend you were the president for like two minutes. You probably become president because you have something to do with politics. You usually don't come out of like thin air and you're like a normal person. The president can make treaties with other nations, but he has to be approved by the Senate first. The president can influence what the public thinks. You can employ ambassadors and Supreme Court justices, but you have to ask the Senate what they think first. President Houston resigned and then Gerald Ford, President Gerald Ford came here. The president wouldn't just say, I want to make this happen. It would, it would have to go past, like, Congress. How do they learn how to be president? You don't, there's no, like, a school. It's a like president school. It's, you just, you have to, you have to just usually you, you just have to become elected. Can president give more than 100 votes? This is called if I were president. If I were president, I would make sure that everything was fair. I would try to make a difference in the USA. One of the good things about being president is that you get to make a lot of speeches. I like making speeches. The best thing about being president is you get to sleep in a canopy bed. You have a lot of power in the government where other people like the legislative and the judicial, they all have to share it between all the people there. The president, you are just as equal as them, but it's just one person. If you're president and you don't think a law Congress passed is a good one, you can veto it or propose new laws to Congress. You will um, appoint all officers of the United States and basically that's um, you will be the head of the executive branch. I think a good president would be, uh, he'd have to be, he or she would have to be responsible. Doesn't say that women can't be presidents, but there hasn't been any women presidents. I think there should be a woman president in the United States of America. I don't think there's been a woman president because no woman has ever run for president. I think that I could be president one day. I can't become president because I was born in Italy. To be president, you have to be born in the United States. I'd like to change the Constitution so that people in, from other nations can become presidents. If I were president, I would make sure that there was no violence. I would make sure that nobody had to live per poorly. I think the worst thing is that the minute you do something wrong, the press is all over you. The worst thing about being president is you'll have to sit through long, boring meetings. The whole entire country is depending on you. You have to, like, make phone calls. Living in the White House would be great, of course. It's like a palace. Um, the White House has um, a movie theater, and it's got its own bowling alley. Well, the pay, I bet the, they pay you pretty good, too. Does the president make money? 
Once a year, the president gives a serious speech to the whole country about what is going on in the United States. The Constitution says that in special cases, you can call meetings with the House of Representatives and the Senate. In class, we're studying um, presidents, and I did this portrait of Lyndon Johnson. Oh, this is my picture of James Buchanan, and he was the 15th president. This is my portrait of Thomas Jefferson, and he was the third president. They thought he was a bit lonely, so he, they sent him a herd of elephants and to a pair of bald eagles and a Newfoundland dog. What does the president eat? As president, you have to be, you, like, you're responsible for the whole entire country. Where does the president eat? If you think like the last presidency was bad, then you can change it. Does the president eat at the White House? To be president would be really interesting. If I could ask the president any question, I would ask, do you cook your own dinner? If you're the president, you have to make sure that the laws of the country are being upheld. You have to entertain and talk to important people from other countries. I have a least favorite president. Well, actually, no, never mind. I don't want to get too political.